So now I'm going to explain to you how creative tabs work and we're going to create our very own creative tab for the mod that we're creating. Basically, creative tabs are a tab which is added to the creative menu in game when you're in creative mode and you can add all of your items to that creative tab so the players can click on it to filter between the items in your mod which distinguishes them from the other vanilla items in their own respective tabs. In basic terms, it's just a tab where all your items are stored in so people can easily access them without having to search for them or browse through all the vanilla tabs so the name of my mod is obviously ancient civilizations you will know the name of your mod so press plus in the top left and we're going to go down and press creative tab and i'm just going to type in creative tab as the name you just type in whatever you'll remember press enter or create new tab the creative tab name for me is just going to be ancient civilizations because i'm going to do one tab right now and have all my items in it but when you have a very large or extensive mod you might want to make a tab for every type of block or item in your mod so to do that you put the name of your mod and then you put dash and then what their tabs for so like weapons for an example and then one might be tools and they'll have a tab for weapons a tab for tools when you create multiple and then the players can click on each one to filter each category of items or blocks in your mod so that's something you can do later but for now i'm just going to type in ancient civilizations just one tab for my mod the tab icon we only have one custom block made in our mod right now so we can only choose from one block as our icon so i'm going to select the only custom block which i've made this block test but i could also select one of the vanilla blocks for an example the chisel sandstone because that's from an ancient civilization that's like an egyptian block so it kind of fits the theme of my mod so i'm going to use that now if you click check to enable search bar this just basically allows players in game to have a little search bar at the top right in your creative tab so if you have tons and tons of items in it then they can search for those items so i'm just going to check that and press save mod element and now we've created our creative tab but before we save our creative tab i want to quickly show you before we also test it how to add items to your creative tab because you need to know this for later otherwise you won't know how it works so we're going to go to our test block again we created in the first lesson and i'm going to double click it to edit it this is the same for items you can do this with items you can do this for mob spawn eggs you can do this for blocks you can do this with anything you can spawn through creative mode right and you want to go down to properties and on blocks there's a tab which there should be for items as well and it says creative inventory tab so we're going to click on this to change it and at the top we have the creative tab that's just what i called it it will show the name that you called your creative tab and i'm going to click it and now when we press save this will put our custom block in our creative tab and you have to do this for every single item so if you've already made tons of items and blocks and you want them in a custom tab you have to go back and edit all of them okay if you're lucky enough to just be starting out with your mod then now you need to do this for every single element that you create so every item you create every block you create to make sure they show up in that tab so now we're going to press the little play button in the top right to run the client and let's go test it out so now we're in game so if we press e to open up our inventory and we press this little right arrow to go to the end we now have a tab for our mod so my mod ancient civilizations let's click it and now we have the test block over here which we can spawn and drag in from this tab so now we have our custom block inside our creative tab now here is the search box which we added you can remove this my mods name overflows into the search bar because it's so long that might be annoying for you so you can just uncheck the search bar and if i just type in for an example the name of the block which would be test block it'll come up with a block okay it's as simple as that how to add creative tabs to your mod